All right, Coach, huge win. First time we beat Moorhead since we won a championship here nine years ago almost. So. Uh, it was really big for us. I mean, they're, uh, they're obviously a really good team. Sean does a great job. Uh, you know, we had every opportunity to lay down and, uh, and fold, and uh, we didn't. We made free throws. We got key stops. You know, Taman went out and going into overtime. And uh, you know what? We found a way, and we gutted out a win, and it's a, it's a big win for our program. Four players of double figures. Has to be nice to get so much parity among that score sheet. For sure. You know, um, you know, we talk about sharing the ball and, um, and getting everyone involved, and we were able to do that. It's nice to actually shoot the ball uh, a little bit better tonight. And uh, I, I just can't say enough about the resilience of uh, this team. You know, we had a really tough loss against EKU. And uh, we just found a way to, uh, to, to win a really good, real, against a really good team. One thing you have to do in wins is limit turnovers. You held it to only 10, which is always a great number to keep it within and around that single digit rank realm. So talk about that pressure yeah. defense. Uh, I tell you what, we, the last two games, we've done a really good job of, of taking care of the basketball. Um, you know, EKU, we had 11. They were averaging turning people over by 20. Um, Moorhead's pressure, they're known for. And we were to take care of the ball. We were able to knock down some key shots. And it was just a huge win. And I thought Chandler Rowe uh, was, just came up huge, took some big charges, got on the floor for loose balls, um, just did everything that we needed to do to win. Arkeem Joseph, a player that really answered when the bell was rung. Without question. I thought Arkeem was really good. Uh, it was a good matchup for Arkeem. And uh, he was able to go in there and uh, he, he provide a post presence, which we haven't had uh, for a long time, to be honest, since Miles went out. And hopefully our team can, uh, can catch his stride and uh, really help us down the stretch. One and one in the league heading to Tech on Thursday. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, like I said, we thought we'd let one get away, but uh, it's always good to, uh, to get a, a home win against a really good team. And uh, we obviously have to, you know, this league is uh, it's going to be a dogfight every night. we got to be ready to go. There's 14 more nights, and uh, hopefully we come out on top more than not. Thanks, Coach. Thank you.